What up, Internet? I'm Young Guru, and welcome back to Dark Souls. In the last episode, we defeated the Abyss Watchers, and we are now back in the shrine. There's a bunch of people here, so let's talk to them. Ah, uh, I know you. Be some time. I just dropped in to see how she's getting on. Now, what are you playing at with this circus? This cesspool of doddering old folk and degenerates. Couldn't be better. She must fit in perfectly here. <laughs> this place is a cesspool I couldn't hope for better. <laughs> there you go, so he's happy. You can piss him off if you give her um, the dark tome. And we have that here. Deep Grail Divine Tome. Tome of the Deep, belonging to the Deacons of the Cathedral. Intended to teach divine protection to the Deacons of the Deep, but later dark tales were added to its pages, such that it is now considered a thing profane. So that'll... Uh, Teach her dark miracles, which will corrupt her, and her buddy will get mad. Cinders of a lord, left by the Abyss Watchers. If the lords will not return to their thrones themselves, let them return as cinders. The Watchers of the Abyss swore upon their shared wolf's blood, which also served as their mandate as lords. And the soul of the Abyss Watchers is soul of the blood of the wolf. The blood was spread amongst the Abyss Watchers, and their souls are one with the soul of the Wolf Blood Master. Delightful. So we will be converting that into something amazing. Mm -hmm. Force the Hushed. Or are you two? And Honorary. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Let's try that again. Honorary, where you at? Oh, and we meet again. We spoke before on the road of sacrifices. Anri of Astora. I'm well pleased to see you safe. We reached the Cathedral of the Deep, but Aldridge's coffin was empty. The man-eater must have left for his true home. The little doll in the empty coffin told me. Aldridge is said to hail from Irithil in the Boreal Valley, an ancient fabled city. A pilgrim told me that the city lies beyond Farren Keep. And so becomes our destination. Aldridge's honest home is Irithil in the Boreal Valley, an ancient fabled city. A pilgrim told me that the city lies beyond Farren Keep, and so becomes our destination. So I really like this. Henri and you are on the same journey. Except Henri is young, I am old and wise, and I have felled my share of, of kings. Talk to your buddy here. Aha, thou returned, and a fine day it is. So, happened upon any twisted souls? Oh, indeed I have, my friend. So what do we get? Crystal Hail, Deep Soul, Boulder Heave. It's Deep Soul, what is that from? Oh, Deacons of the Deep, oh yeah. They also give you the Cleric's Candlestick. Ooh, guiding light. That's kind of cool. Can't actually use it though. So this is the the top thing. Where do you come from? Soul of Straight, straight Demon increases max equip load. Oh, I'm gonna be getting that. Much better than Boulder Heave. Let's get that real quick. A ring for warriors keen on heavy accoutrements. This ring was named after Havel the Rock, the battlefield compatriot of Gwyn, the First Lord. The art of war has been a constant since ages past, and those who would follow in Havel's footsteps are no fewer now than in his own day. Alright, so with the Blood of the Wolf, you get one of two items. Artorius' Wolf Knight Greatsword, of a knight tainted by the Dark of the Abyss and Master of the Wolf's Blood of Farron. The Wolf Knight was the first Abyss Watcher, and his sword is more punishing against creatures of the Abyss. Um, so you can do like a flipping overhead attack or a spinning ground attack. It's kind of amazing. It's 
broken. Also cost 10k. That's how you know it's better. You see and D, this is D and C. Oh, so you're just switching what your main focus stat is. It also weighs less. Theron Greatsword of the Abyss Watchers, which is atypically paired with an unusual dagger. The dagger is utilized as a wedge in the left hand, while the greatsword is held in the right. A unique technique that was synonymous with the Undead Legion. Confounds foes in the manner of wolves hunting prey. Allows you to parry. So we're gonna go with this. Bring back that classic parry now, now. action. Do not be away over long. Um, I ah, forgot so. to. Ah, most illustrious Lord Seeker. Or should I say, Lord Slayer? Fine kindling for the thrones, is it not? Each soul truly worthy of lordship. And all slain by thy hand to bind them to their thrones, even in death. Oh, I have no qualms. For as we are to our thrones, thou art to thy duty. In fact, methinks thou hast helped these poor lords along their rightful path. Ah, most... Oh, in Thank now, you, Lilith. Do not be away, oh. All right. We... Our, uh, our buddy has left. Both are gone now. No, you're still here, Renard. Now invade and pillage, and if you come on... No, you're just going to keep saying the same thing over and over. Um, I'm a super fan that that didn't cost me anything to um buy my weapon. Ah, tis good, wasn't he? Can I reinforce? Nope. Uh, reinforced weapon, though. We got here, fair and great sword. What is this? 216 and 123. Well, that's just nowhere near as strong as this. Huh. That's a shame. You're plus four. You're plus three. Damn. Pretty big like that. A weaker weapon, but what are you gonna do? I want my parry action. I also think it's quicker. If I'm not mistaken. Even if you two-handed. But does it not matter? Oh, you still pull the blade out. <laughs> oh, that's wild. So I can two-hand the weapon and the blade's out. Which is the whole point of it. Let's see if the attack pattern's different. Attack pattern's the same. Uh, because my offhand is empty, I always parry. It's just whether or not I'm holding the blade in my hand. Interesting. Uh, so, because we've defeated the Abyss Watchers... Ooh, you are so fucking expensive. Why'd I buy the helmet? What a mistake that was. Oh, that's an entire level lost. Um, what about to do? How's your weight compare? You up the weight, but somehow I'm lighter than I was before. It's kind of wild. Expected to be... How's the weapon compare? You are 12.5. 13. Something is off about my weight. And what's been the levels I put in? Who knows? Uh, attire of the Abyss Watchers, the Undead Legion of Farron. A black dyed leather vest worn over chainmail. These undead warriors vowed to partake of wolf blood. They acted in the dark, seeking out any sign of the abyss, fighting a constant war with its abominations. Black dyed leather tied around the arms, with only the left fitted with a gauntlet. The iron kneecaps originated from their sword techniques. Oh, I guess, yeah, that's the other thing. So, strong attack. But if you're off-handed... No? Why? 
There it is. There's my my L1. And you just kind of go over and over again with it. There it is. One. Two. Well, I don't have the stamina. And I think if I'm not double equipped, I'll punch. Okay. That's the difference. And with that, that I don't need, need any focus points. So I'll go ten. Pretty be careful. Oh, what a shame that I bought that helmet by mistake. I guess I didn't read the text on it. The pointed steel helm was a distinct symbol of the Legion, shirked as a sinister omen by the masses. Welcome us. Very well, then take me. Yeah, that would have been a level. What a shame. We are going to consume these other souls that... I have no interest in, sold the curse wire rotted great wood. Ever since its establishment, all manner of curses have managed to seep into the undead settlement. The worst of them were sealed away inside a spirit tree, but eventually the curses took their toll. Three K Um Soul of a Crystal Sage. The twin crystal sages once served as spiritual guides to the scholars of the Grand Archives, and one went on to ally with the Undead Legion. And we're gonna need the last one as well. After Aldris left for the Boreal Valley, Archdeacon Royce remained in the cathedral with the High Priestess. High Priests to keep eternal watch over their master's coffin. I think I already read that one. Holy Welcome shit, 20,000. Very well, then tuck Haken up. See if I can get two levels out of this. Endurance. No, oh, I can get two. You get three, you get two. Um, and my carrying capacity is fine. So I think I'm going to get Dex up to 30. And I'll figure out from there. Farewell, Ashen One. Perry. Oh boy. I don't know if I know the parry timing in this game at all. We'll see. We will find out. Thinking of the bosses coming up, and <laughs> like none of them are parryable. I uh, back in Farron Keep towards the Lord Vessel here. I think they all have a Lord Vessel, if I'm not mistaken. Or what appears to be a Lord Vessel. That pulls back and what do you know? Catacombs of Carthus. Uh, you can drop down, take a shortcut to the right. We ain't gonna do that. These skeletons will revive a few times over. I think that's the mechanic here. You know when they finally give you experience. So that one's dead. Carthus Rouge. Oh my god, that's not a defensive move. Okay, good. You gotta hit L1 over and over again. Oh, <laughs> get fucked, buddy! Titanite shards. I don't want those. I want scales. This doesn't feel all that much faster than the other weapon. I think that other weapon has long. This one has a longer reach. That seems to be the only... Oh my lord, not paying attention. The only real benefit to this one has got to be the reach. Get you gone. Okay, these are ones and dones. Sniper up above. Do my best not to spawn all these fools. Hello, buddy. 
What happened to your head? I really hope my logic on this, like, if you get XP. Okay, sniper. You done. That's, that's the other thing. Oh, boy. The other weapon does not have this spinning attack. It is just bonkers ground coverage. I lose my attack and retreat maneuver, which I loved. I don't think I killed you. Hopefully I did. We should. You did come around the corner. Um. No, we want to continue. Oh boy, this is all confusion. Be wary of trap. Oh lord. I thought that was a singular shot. Luckily it worked out in the end. So dusty. Soul of a nameless soldier. Could have a couple snipers in here. This... Sickle-wielding bastard. Come on, this, this one's kind of obvious. Oh, and the drop! And you're done. Carthus Pyromancy Tome. Delightful. More tomes that I'm not going to use. <laughs> you just fell down? Um, that is death, I'm pretty sure. You can just roll down to here, though, from the bridge. Maybe you got to jump, but... You can get down here pretty quick. I wish I should have bought some throwing daggers. Can it be done? Oh no, it can't be done. Ooh, Kukiri. Kukri? Not Kukiri. A sharp gem that I'm not gonna ever use. Um, I think you're alone. Oh, wow, I expected a little more time. you with that spinning flip. Christ. I don't trust myself to parry this thing. It hits too hard. And I'm dead. Oh. Good, good, good. use the one problem of being embered is you lose the benefit of unembering if that's the right phrase when uh or getting an ember when you defeat a boss yeah this is the way we're gonna go we're gonna take the shortcuts a little bit risky. I gotta run up the stairs in opposition of a boulder. Boulder of skeletons. 
Oops. Amber, I think I'm safe here. Please tell me I'm safe here. Well, you got fucked. Got you with the bop. Their own kukris all up on my dome. That sniper bastard. Got, a, got an arrow in my head. Whoop. Okay, we revived. Oh, that was like one K souls. That's fine. Didn't you die? Well, now you're dead. Park this Rouge. Titanite Shard. So we came in up there, across the bridge, and we have come down here. Um, hmm. Hey, buddy. I'm gonna go back up because I don't remember if there's an item up on that ledge and you're alive. You're both alive. Okay, both still dead. Gotta go all the way to the top. Hey buddy boo. At a moment of panic that he was in a pairing stance, which would have been immensely embarrassing. So let me just sneak around here. Yeah, buddy. Come attack me. Ooh, way too soon on that parry. Gotcha, buddy. One of you. Come on. Got you. And you. I'll figure my parry windows out eventually. I think this is where the older of bones drops off of. Yeah, I think it's right here. Okay, let's go find our friend Henri. Ooh, that heavy landing. I will gladly take that cheap kill. Feel like you're set up to do that. All four standing in front of you. Charge that fool hard. What's going on, Re? Oh, hello. How very fortunate. Have you seen my companion, Horace? To my shame, I was snared by a trap and we've become separated. I've not been able to find him since. Yes, I see. Horace is a valiant knight. He can look after himself, no question. He's probably searching for me right now, with twice the resolve. If you happen upon him, please tell him that I remained in the catacombs, and I will lay prison stones to guide him, as always. Please send him word, I beg of you. May the flames guide your way. If you happen upon horror... Okay, you're just repeating yourself. You only say one thing. Can I kick with this weapon? Yes, I can. I've never been good at kicking in this game. It's eluded me all the way from the first game to now. Twinkling Titanite. I eventually will upgrade the other sword to plus five, because why not? Um, 
I don't think you can safely make a jump from here. Wow. I should really look at the game screen when I'm talking and playing. Okay. Can't make that jump. Maybe you can. I'm not going to risk it. Keep hitting L1 to uh, check my souls. With that go rolling past us. Keep it rolling, rolling, rolling. Do love this boulder. It's just a fantastic one. I think we should safely be able to get to the bonfire. Oh, what are you doing? You got a runner. Eventually this thing will shatter against the wall. I don't remember what you have to do to make that happen, but it's a thing. Am I close to the bonfire? I might not be. Well, you are not a, a spinning. Attack one bit. Ow, what the f Fuck. There's where am I? You're done. Okay, you're actually done. Ah. Oh, we yeah, have the pots. Have this stuff. Oh, and that dude is throwing shit at me. That's your back attack. I'm gonna try poking this thing. There's a, a ring inside of it, I do believe. So maybe you gotta hit it. Give it one more thwack. Maybe there's not a ring in it. Maybe I'm making shit up. Huh. I might... I'll look up how to do that. There's a way. I think there's a way. There might not be a way. Well, you didn't spew any toxic poison at me. That's crazy. This bastard will, though. Okay, so certain of the pots will. That guy gave me experience. Delightful. Okay, it's the ones that are covered. Just want to be careful with your rolls. That's that's one. Crack this milk ring. I think that makes you a little bit invisible when you roll. I don't think it does anything to actually defend you. Ow, what the fuck? Um, it's just visually, you go invisible. Uh, I kind of wanted to say that. What am I doing? For this enemy, you can use the traps to your advantage. See, we see that guy with his invisibility. Oh, wow, I can't roll quick enough. That's a shame. Okay. We can quickly get back here, though. No longer need to explore the upper area. This is going to be a long fucking episode. Oh, well. I'm not at a good break right now. And we're almost at the bonfire. I think. I hope. I could be wrong. Hopefully by the end of this episode I will be comfortable with this weapon again. There's you. And you.
Yeah, I don't know what that dude running actually does. Oh, yeah, it broke this time. Undead bone chart. Ooh, I do love that. Look at this tail. We should be able to raise this. The lever is broken. What a shame. Dude, it's just the worst. He's dropping a bombs. That's the other thing, I think if they have glowing eyes, then they're coming back to life. This guy had no glowing eyes. I think, yeah, he just dies in one hit. Okay. Check this maneuver out. Love it. Love it. Hit you with your own trap. get that parry on. Parrying is something I never really got effective with in Dark Souls 2. You can kind of do it, but oh, that reset already. Halfway decent in Dark Souls 1. You fucking bastard. I don't remember what side of the room this thing is coming from. So we're gonna hit and quit. And we're stuck in the corner. Fuck you, game. Okay, only one of you though, Cam. Bleeding. And get my parry on. Get my parry on, parry on, parry on. Large shards. Should mean I can click off this trap again. Do it, do it! Oh, everybody escaped that one. Just so acrobatic. Dead Knight shards, things I don't need. Large soul of an unknown. Pit to drop to your death. Watch out! And when Ember. Skip the moment. Wheel of Death. Is there anything back there? Yeah, there is. Oh, Christ. Large shard. Well, that was not worth it. And with that, we are gonna call it an episode because we've been going for a while. I'm Young Guru. Thank you for joining me, and I will see you next time.